Hello, hello, hello. This is Rich Kale here on YouTube. Rich Gen X Elsewhere. And it is time to continue with Whispers of a Machine. And, uh... Okay, so now we have, uh... We can go to the museum. So we're gonna go in there. Interesting. <clears throat> Let's start uh, scanning around for stuff. No. Nope. Nothing. Okay, that's Carl's bio. I don't want to do a smart scan. Now that this place is open, I want to start looking around for stuff. Carl's bio. Nothing. Late shape. Nothing on the blade shape. Let's check the boot print. Nothing on the boot print. Maja's bio. So far, nothing. Okay, and what about Leonard's DNA? Okay, so nothing DNA-wise here. Okay. Damn, there's a lot of here. Interesting buttons that can be pushed. This facility has been deemed compliant with the third decree, 12th Amendment, on November 4th, 79 AR. Hmm. Path of the Pilgrim. Hmm. Kind of an odd name for an exhibition about the collapse. Yeah, that is odd. It shows various star constellations. Apparently the ones we plan to explore with some incredible new rocket engine that they were about to finish when the collapse happened. Huh. It's hard to think that most people had several of these in their homes once upon a time. Well, not so hard. Push the button. Oh. It shows very... Oh! Due to the third decree, AI today is practically non-existent outside sanctioned laboratory conditions. French huh. terrorist groups such as the Conduit and N Protocol (EP) still try to resurrect AI, but have been successfully fought and nearly wiped out by authorities. Hmm. Critics of the nano substance Blue claim that despite it lacking CPUs, it is a form of intelligence neural network warranted to be included in the Third Decree. Defenders of Blue tend to cite the Fourth Amendment, where transhumanism efforts in the form of human augmentation are declared legal. However, the hmm. Fourth Amendment was written before the discovery of Blue, when primitive mechanical and cybernetic implants were the only options for human augmentation. Interesting. The human wave post over time other the human Wait. wave was a loose affiliation of political and religious movements with the supreme goal of eradicating AI. It is widely considered to be the largest single cause of the collapse. Hmm. Post collapse, the movement continued its activities to some extent up to 4AR but gradually lost its ability to maintain any larger operations due to the extensive deglobalization. Hmm. Over time, the subgroups of the human wave splintered back into their original factions. Some, having accomplished their goals, ceased to exist completely. Others, hmm. like the Church of Epos, Earth Preservation Orthodox Society, were formed to find a new place in a post-collapse world. Hmm. A regeneration pod kept people healthy and energetic. Huh. Hmm. No idea what this is. Must have been some kind of local thing. I remember reading about some military experiment gone haywire in these parts. Maybe this is it. Oh, well, what does pushing the button do? Hmm. I'm pretty sure these were flown on out hostlessly, and that some famous world leader got killed by hackers who took control of her vehicle. A terrorist, a terrorist group named responsibility, responsibility, and there, and there was a bloody civil war. Hmm. Mm. 
Interesting. Looks like this is model model compound broke pre pre lapse. There's huh. no crack caused by the hyper bill failure, and the crater crater field is nowhere near CC. Huh. Looks like this is model model. Okay. Well, we've pretty much checked everything out. Except for the military wow, robot. This thing must have been here some back in the Let's see what the button does. Interesting. Hmm. Huh. Okay. So we've learned stuff. I go upstairs see if there's anything new here. <laughs> Let's check with his DNA around here. I don't think I'll find anything in here, but you know, never know. Okay. Of course, the exhibition sketch. It's a sketch of the exhibition downstairs. It's titled Path of the Pilgrim. Yes, we know that. Okay, so I don't think there's anything new here. Uh, let's see. No need to go back in. No need to go back in there. Okay. So. Can I go? Looks like an old. Looks like an old hovercraft. Yeah. All right. Let's take some of our new information and uh, talk to. Uh... Oh, let's talk to Gabriel. Hello again, Gabriel. Hey there. Can I be of assistance? Well, let's see. I'm looking for a nutrient canister. Know where I can get my hands on one of those? No idea. But didn't Maya have some kind of machine in her apartment for that sort of thing? Oh yeah, you're right. Oh. Well, there. All right, I'm off. Good luck out there. So I'll have to go back there, okay. All right. Let me see here. I don't think I need to look her up. I don't think I need... Is there anything else I can look up? Alright. Let's uh, talk with Commissary Anderson. I had a few questions, Commissary. By all means. I learned that Leonard's death wasn't an accident. He was placed in that machine after his death. Hmm. I suspected as much. Any leads on his killer? Some. I found the weapon that killed Carl and Maya in the recycling center, but it's clean. Hmm. So the murderer must have stashed it there after disposing of Leonard. Probably. Yeah. It was placed in the metal recycler, so maybe the killer meant for it to get smelted down and destroyed. Sounds like a plausible theory. Yeah. I'm looking for a nutrient canister. No one can get my hands on one of those. A nutrient what? Never mind. Okay. So let's, uh... Do you know who Katarina Berg is, the school teacher? She also calls herself Melinda. Sorry, I'm bad with names. Okay. Did you know Leonard Dahl? Not at all. I only first learned his name this morning. Hmm. Any idea of what this opens? Nope. Not a clue. Okay. This weapon killed Carl and Maya. I found it in the recycling center. Then all three killings must be connected. Great work, Agent. We're one step closer to catching the killer. Hmm. Yeah, let's this weapon killed Carl and Maya. Let's see if I'm... I found it in the recycling center. I just want to double check the reactions. Three killings must be connected. Great work, Agent. We're one step closer to catching the killer. Yep. Any idea of what this opens? Nope. Not a clue. 
Okay. Did you know Leonard Dahl? Not at all. I only first learned his name this morning. Do you know who Katarina Berg is, the school teacher? She also calls herself Melinda. Sorry, I'm bad with names. Okay. All That's right. all I needed. Very well. So. Let's get that nutrient canister and get that taken care of. So we need to figure something out. I have no clue what this thing does, but it looks like it could have something to do with processing samples. No. But this one, this is the one. Some kind of airtight container. It's labeled nutrients. Hmm. I don't think this is the nutrient canister I'm looking for. The receptacle on the womb tank was much smaller. This looks mm. like some kind of dispenser, though. So if I find the right container, I might be able to refill it here. Okay. Alright, so now that's another lead, another thing. Go to the canteen. Maybe there's something in there. I don't have anything. I don't have. No. Okay. Nothing here. I think they delivered. Okay. Looks like an old file. Various hand. All right. All right. So now we have to figure something out. More runes. Seems to be a common thing in Northland. Alright, let's go back to North Town. A mural depicting some kind of abstract art. Mm, can't take that ladder. I wonder if that key will go to something in here. It's the key I found in the recycle. This is probably where Leonard handled all of the paperwork. That combination. I don't. There's something about the crates. A few crates of different sizes. Maybe for transporting some of the recycled materials. Hmm. Various tools and lots of knives headed for recycling. Hmm. Yeah, that's not helping any. Anything in the bin? About half filled with God knows what. Pretty stinky. Mm. All right, let's go back to that mall. Maybe that can give me something. I don't know. All right, let's go to the mall. I just have that feeling. Maybe later. I don't feel an urge for a coffee break right now. Hmm. Doesn't look functional. There 
Not sure what happened here, but it looks like... I think that leads to a church of some kind. No reason to go up there at the moment. Okay. Let's go back to the junk heap. I need to find some sort of clue. Door, solar panels, distant tower to junk heap. Junk heap. The junk piles extend some half a mile into the empty eastern part of town. I doubt they're being added to, though. Nordson residents seem conscientious about recycling. Not sure where that door leads. That combination. Hmm. All right. Well, let's. Uh... I don't have a reason to visit the junk heap right now. <sighs> All right. Looks like an apartment. Nice spot there. And and it's Yeah. Hi again. Hey there. What can I do you for? Well, let's uh Hey, Walter. Do you happen to have any containers for liquid nutrients? Oh. I'm fresh out of those. Sold my last one to Maya Strand. Said she was working on a processing unit for a high-energy liquid food solution. Like people actually want to eat goo. Interesting. Hi. Thanks anyway. Let's see. Did you know Leonard Dahl? A little. He came by every now and then buying things for the recycling center. We've been talking about automating some of the work there. Yeah? Anything out of the ordinary about him? I wouldn't say so. He was a quiet, nice guy. A real shame what happened to him. Hmm. Do you know where I can find the school teacher, Melinda? I'm not sure who that is. What does she look like? Light brown hair, fair skin, mid-twenties or so? Oh, just my type! <laughs> All your type, Nissa. That's not true, Pops. Only women. And, well, some robots. Okay. Quiet boy, she's not interested in your goddamn preferences. <clears throat> now, agent, there's a lot of ladies like that in Nordson. A picture would certainly be helpful. Okay. I have one right here, but it's not much to look at. You weren't joking. I can't do much with this. Let me know if you find a better one. Okay, Fair so enough. yeah. I will. Ever see this key before? Nope. First time. It uh, looks really nice. Okay. Nah, I don't want to scare the poor guy. Okay. I'm off. See you later. Take care. Bye bye, police lady. Hmm. Let's go through the school again. Something tells me there's something there. Pictures of teachers and staff decorate the wall. Some are from way back when the school was founded. No names anywhere, though. There are a number of women here who could be Katarina, but it's hard to be sure without something specific to go on. I don't need to run. I think the children grew these themselves. That's good. Gives them some practical skills. Drawings of different plants and trees with close-ups of their nuts, leaves, and seeds. Yeah. Nothing out of the ordinary, but I doubt Katarina would hide anything in here. Too exposed. Hmm. Yeah, I didn't think I'd find anything here. Yeah, I didn't think that'd be either. I 
wish he knew what I'm looking for here. Nothing. I don't need to run various books and office supplies. Mm. Very what about the calendar? Plenty of outdoor activities planned for the children. Hmm. Looks disconnected. Probably not worth the energy. Hmm. Looks like a few kids left some of their clothes here. Can I go in the classroom? Empty. Guess there are no classes today. Well, I don't know. I'd take that as a chance to snoop around. Oh my gosh. But... She might have a nutrients canister in there. Some old pre-collapse gadgets, probably for the museum. Nice collection of mushrooms. Looks like the edible kind. Mm. This crude bed looks regularly used. Not that I'm expecting anything, but you know. Not sure what kind of plants those are. Maybe medicinal? Doesn't look like vegetables anyway. A trophy in the shape of a robotic arm with a plaque. Winner of the 2041 Annual Nordstrom Awards, Sebastian Strand. An old relative of Maya's? Hmm. See, this doesn't tell me anything. All right, let's do some more exploring. Tower to edge. There's gotta be something. The town square, nothing here, great. Nice and shiny. I can even see my reflection in it. Hmm. Let's see if he's down here. Nope, he's not down here. Let's see, let's check patient room. Maybe there's a canister in here or something. Various medical supplies. Nothing there. No, nothing, nothing. Not expecting anything there. No. Smart scan. Looks like no patient. What's the blue box? It's filled with cannulas, those little needle things used to connect an IV. Okay. And I don't think I need one right now. A portable medical, unused bandages, an old pre-collapse monitor, probably not connected. Mm-hmm. I don't need any. Okay. Okay, so that's a wash. Get stymied here. An old freight elevator. Let's see if I can go in this door here. No use. It doesn't fit. Mm, it was worth a try. 
Do I want to try it? Uh, it's too strong. Interesting. Too strong. That's actually curious. Back to North Town. Maybe I'm missing something. Let me check the recycling center again. Maybe I am missing something, but I don't know what. Guess that's the intake. Let me get everything out of here. Yeah, they did. Ugh, this is quite a mess. I'm not equipped to deal with this. I'll have to ask Dr. Pearson if Yeah, but he's not in. A few crate. I don't think... What's this? So that didn't do me any good. What's the trolley? Can I move it? This thing is used to transport metals to the... This thing is... No need to do... Okay! What am I missing? I'm missing something. I feel it. The junk pile. I dealt there. Be a, light a light beacon marking the northern edge of the town disk. Hmm. I can't help but think I'm missing something. Looks like an apartment. There's something I'm missing. I'm certain of it. Let's talk to Gabriel, see if Hello I can Hello again. Hey there. I found this among Leonard's remains. Ah, oh, probably his key then. Unless the killer dropped it in there. In any case, I don't know what it opens. I found this among Leonard's remains. Ah, uh, probably his key then. Unless the killer dropped it in there. In any case, I don't know what it opens. Okay. All right, I'm off. Good luck out there. I need information. A collection of what? Just. Looks like a logbook. I guess Anderson. I just, I know I need something. I'm certain of it. I don't need to look. I don't need to. Look. I don't think I. I don't think. I don't. I don't. I don't. It's a bloody photograph of Carl and a young woman. Taken. F He's holding hands with the woman, but I can't discern her face. Too much damage to the photo. Hmm. She's wearing a brass necklace. Could be relevant. Oh! Duh! Brass necklace could be relevant. Now, yes, it is relevant. Pictures of teachers and staff decorate the wall. Some are from way back when the school was founded. No names anywhere, though. There are a number of women here who could be Katarina, but it's hard to be sure without something specific to go on. Okay, 
Let's see if I can find any there similarities between any of these women and the picture I have. Oh, right here. Same brass necklace. This has got to be her. All right, I took the picture. Perhaps someone will recognize her. Yes, now we can get information. It took me a while, but I found it. Let's see uh, who knows her. Although I think it's going to be a bit, uh, bit better. Bigger build up. Hello again. Hey there, there. Can I be of assistance? assistance? Do you recognize this woman? Sure, that's Melinda. She's, uh... She's what? She's just kind of cute, 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 that's all. <laughs> Do you recognize this woman? Sure, that's Melinda. She's, uh... She's what? She's just, just kind of cute, 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 that's all. <laughs> okay. All right. all right. Good luck out. All right, let's go to Anderson. I have to do this a little bit longer since uh, it took a while to find what I, I needed. I had a few questions, Commissary. By all means. Do you, do you recognize, recognize this woman? That's the young, young tourist, is it? Yes, I found the picture in the school. Oh, school. I see. I don't, I don't know, know much, much about, about her. Okay. That's, That's all, all I needed. Very well. All right, so let's go talk to uh, that Vooter and Vooter 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 and Nisi or I can't pay, I can't talk when it comes to that guy's name. Ah, uh, Walter. Hey, Walter. Hi, hi again. Hey there. Hey, what what did I do you for? Do you, do you know this woman? Oh, her. I sometimes spot her off the path, path, actually. Oh? You do? Where? By the junkie. Don't know what business she's got there, there but I notice her sometimes when I collect parts. Oh. She thinks nobody sees her, all sneaky and quick. But I, I, I got keep eyes. Perfect. Perfect. Thanks a lot, Walter. Now we know. I'm off. See you later. Take care. Take care. Now we have a police lady. Now we know something. And a lead. Off to the junk heap. Aha! Hey, you wanna go do something? I'm tired. Let's just hang out. You wouldn't be tired if you ate breakfast. What are you, my dad? I feel sick in the morning. Shut up. Whatever. Hmm. Looks like he's holding some kind of map. Looks like... Hmm. Hey, kids. Uh, hey. Theo, that's the lady that Miss M... Shut up, Alicia! Oh! Now, wait a minute. Alicia, is it? You know Miss M? I, uh... Of course we do, ma'am. We're kids. She's our teacher. Yeah, we just know her from school and stuff. Right. So you haven't seen Miss M around today, have you? Uh-uh. Nope. Hmm. Well, I have a few questions for you. Okay. Do you know what happened yesterday to a man named Carl? My friend told me that somebody murdered him with a knife. I bet it was totally gross. I bet you wouldn't say that if you saw it for real, Theo. You'd just be sad. Not all. Yeah, huh? Just like when we found that dead bird. Shut up! It was different. What do you think of Commissary Anderson? Yeah. He's okay, I guess. He came by the school once and talked about catching criminals and stuff. Yeah, that was fun. It sucks that there's no women in our police station, though. I noticed. But it's not like that in most places. 
In the city, it's almost 50-50. Really? Do you think I could be in the police one day? Like you? Sure, kid. Nothing's stopping you. Huh. When I become a policewoman, I'll arrest you all the time, Theo. Oh, dream on! <laughs> Do you know who Stina Ruth is? Yeah. She works with my mom, the mayor. Stina is pretty cool. I like how she isn't treating like a kid. I see. How does your mom like working with Stina? I know they fight sometimes, but mom says that's why she likes having Stina around. She doesn't like people who always agree. <laughs> Sounds like a good quality in the leader. I guess. Uh. So, did you guys ever hang out with Maya Strand? Hang out? No way. She didn't really like kids. Oh. She liked me, sort of. But this one time, she got real angry with Alicia. Oh? Oh, yeah? Why? I just wanted to try all her stupid stuff. Alicia was, like, running around and pressing all the buttons. And Maya totally freaked out. That sucked. I was just messing around, and she started yelling at me. Mm. Yeah, Maya used to be fun. When we were little, she'd talk about history and stuff. Oh? Now she only talks to herself, like a crazy lady. Not anymore. She's dead, Allie. Okay, whatever. Sorry, I guess. Mm. What do you guys think of Dr. Pearson? He's kind of weird, but nice. Every time I see him, he teaches me something new about the human body. Oh. Yeah, he fixed my broken arm, too. It's totally fine now. Look! Oh, well, seems to have healed up nicely. What happened? Yeah. It totally wasn't my fault. I like climbing and went up my favorite path in the junk heap. But somebody had messed it up, so I slipped. Ouch. Oh. Better be more careful. <sighs> yeah, I know. Do you guys know Walter? Yeah, he's the best. Nisa is my favorite. Mommy even made a cute hat for him once. Cool. <laughs> yeah, and then Nisa said it looked like an old carpet and made some poo poo. He's so funny. <laughs> do you guys know Gabriel? Yeah, he's a cop, but he doesn't have a gun like you do. Policemen should have guns. My dad has like four of them, and he's just a baker, not a policeman. Hey. Can I hold your gun, lady? <laughs> In your dreams, kiddo. <laughs> Do you know Leonard Thal? Yeah. He was... Never mind. It doesn't matter. Okay. So, Katarina is your teacher, right? Nuh-uh. Our teacher's name is Melinda, but she prefers Miss M. Oh. You know, I need to find Miss M really badly. Do you know where she would go if she was ever in trouble? I don't know. We have no idea, man. I think you know more. Now would be the time to tell me before you get into trouble. There's nothing yeah. to say, lady. But Theo, Alicia, chill. We haven't done anything wrong. I guess. Uh -huh. Do you know what happened in the museum last week? Miss M told us in school. She almost cried. I could see tears in her eyes. Hmm. My mom was totally freaked out that day. She had to work late again. Yeah? Hmm. Why is that? I don't know. I guess she had to talk to the police and stuff. Hmm. I doubt these kids know anything about that. Hmm. I doubt these kids know... Do you know what happened in the recycling center today? Uh-uh. Did somebody get hurt? My mom said it wouldn't happen again. Th they would get help from the oh, yeah. Get the bad guys. Yeah, uh, that's me. I'm the help. Wow, they sent a girl? Stop it, Theo. You always say stupid things and get us in trouble. I don't need to show them. No need. No, I don't want to scare them. Hmm. No, I... No, I don't want to scare them. Okay. I don't need to show... Okay. That's all I need, kids. Okay, bye. See ya. I've got some more questions for you. Okay. Fine. No, no, I don't have any more questions. That's all I need, kid. Okay, see ya. Hmm. Now I have a reason to go in there. Uh oh. Okay. 
interesting. So there's something here. I have a feeling there's something here. For Maja's bio, no, 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 and Leonard's DNA, no, I don't think I'm gonna find that, but there's something about this place. Cute outfit, must have taken forever to knit. <laughs> yeah. Old shipping containers, neatly stacked. They look fairly intact. Maybe this area used to be a loading dock, and they proceed the junk heap itself. Old pre-collapsed cars, likely stripped of all usable parts at this point. Yeah. Old pre -collapse. Old pre -collapse. I'm surprised I haven't seen many bicycles around. Yeah. Should be a good mode of transportation around Nordsund. Mm. A big old combustion engine exhaust. You don't see many of those around these days. A refrigerator. I don't really feel like opening it, for my nose's sake. Guess what? A refrigerator. I just have this feeling. A refrigerator. A refrigerator. I don't think extra strength. It's the key I found. Hmm. That act. Old pre. So, now that we've gotten in here, nothing there of interest, but... Ali? Feeling rusted yet? The junk piles extend some half a mile into the empty eastern part of town. I doubt they're being added to. I'll have to check back on that later. I have a feeling there's something more here. Let's go to the mall, see if there's anything new here, and we'll then call it an episode, and... I think that... Not sure. No, nothing here. Maybe. Nothing here. Okay, so that's clear. Okay. Miss M. I'm gonna check up here real quick. Not sure, just have a hunch. No, nothing here. Okay. Oh, I wonder if the uh, doctor's back yet. Now that I know who I was looking for, that might have triggered the doctor to return, and I can at least get that going. Horrible how much death has befallen us. Yes. I read that in a book once. Ah. <laughs> a fitting quote, considering the circumstances. Yeah. Let's see, does he go down here? Not yet! Oh, bugger. One last waiting room. Alright. Let's see if he's back here. No. Nope. So nothing there. Of course, that we talk to the kids, go back in the school, see facing news there. Empty. Get Anything Plenty there. of outdoor. Looks like a. Looks like a few kids. Okay, that doesn't help me either.
Uh, you know, I just had that feeling. Let's just see if this does anything. And, um, I just have that feeling. Looks like he's... Looks like... I'm just playing that. I've got some more questions for you. Okay, fine. Come on, Alicia. I think you know where to find Miss M. I... don't know. We told you already. We don't know. Theo, look at me for a moment. Huh? What? I feel funny. Theo, you okay? Yeah, I just... Wait, what are we doing again? Uh, just hanging out? You're being super weird. Interesting. Hmm? Whatever. Come on, Alicia. I think you know where to find Miss M. I... I don't know. Let's see. Yes, you do. I have ways of knowing when a person is lying. Uh, Theo? I... What? Look, what? Who? Um, on the other side of this tunnel, there's an old fridge with a secret switch on the bottom. Miss M goes through there sometimes. Ah! Thanks. You've been very helpful. Wait, what? Why would you tell her that? But... I'll let you guys, uh, talk this out. <laughs> I knew that fridge was something. Oh, there's some kind of switch under here. There we go. Yeah. Uh-oh. Can't get too close. That's really high voltage. I need to find someone who knows their way around electronics. Ah, well. Ah, now we know. And, uh... Now that we know about that, I'm gonna call it an episode here. As always, this is Rich Kill here on YouTube. Rich Gen X elsewhere. And by you to subscribe to the channel and check out some of the other playthroughs I'm working on. Uh, besides Whispers of a Machine, I am working my way through the uh, LucasArts Library, currently on the Indiana, um, in the Indiana Jones franchise, working my way through Indiana Jones and the Infernal Machine, I am working my way through Abe's Odyssey, New and Tasty, currently on, uh, well, I'm getting close to the end of that one, I do run through the game of Monstrum, I'm working my way through Outlast, and I'm getting close to the end of Outlast, I'm working my way through, uh, uh, Sierra Library. I'm uh, working on the King's Quest franchise right now, and I'm working on King's Quest 2. I'm working my way through uh, the Doom franchise, following Doom Gun slash Doom Slayer. I'm about to finish up Doom 64 on that, and once I'm done with that, I move on, I move on to Doom 2016. For reasons. <laughs> and uh, I'm also working my way through, well, uh, this one's going to be a little tricky right now, because uh, I do not know if I'm continuing Dark Side Detective or if I have to move on to something else. Uh, because I finished the first of the three extra cases that are going to be in the game, but I have not yet had access to the second extra case in the game. Or the third extra case in the game. So if it's ready by the time I reach it again, I'll be playing that. Otherwise, uh, I'll put something else in this place. I don't know what yet. No, I have a good idea what. And I'm working my way, and there's a bunch of other stuff I work my way through that premieres at 3 p.m. Eastern Time every day. Also, every week at 10 a.m. Tuesday through Saturday, and sometimes on Monday I have videos premiering at 10 a.m. Uh, Tuesday is usually a fic reading. Wednesday is I believe, Final Fantasy VII right now. Thursday is either Dead by Daylight or Monster 2. Friday is... 
a fighting game, either story mode or if I'm done with story modes, I'm moving on to ladders. More stories and ladders, it all depends on what I'm playing next. And Saturday is a retrospective for a game I've beaten. So please subscribe to the channel, check everything out, and until next time, as always, this is Rich Kale here on YouTube, Rich Gen X elsewhere. Bye all!